Greetings. This is a significant planetary alignment and earthquake watch for August 24 through September 2nd, 2016. Two very powerful planetary alignments will be taking place on August 24, the Mars-Saturn conjunction, and three days later on August 27, the very powerful Venus-Jupiter conjunction will take place, highlighting this time period as highly volatile, which may imply a significant earthquake registered over 8 magnitude, as well as high solar activity or possible X-class solar flares. The Mars-Saturn conjunction, as well as the Venus-Jupiter conjunction when occurring simultaneously, have coincided with some of the very largest earthquakes, as well as the most significant solar storms in history. We go back to 1938, dubbed the Fatima Storm, produced widely seen auroras right across the Northern Hemisphere, a significant event also occurring at the time of both of these conjunctions occurring near simultaneously. We're now looking at important planetary geometries that will be taking place during this watch, right from August 24, stretching right into September 2nd. Not only do we have the two important planetary conjunctions as mentioned, but Mercury will be forming a stellium with Venus and Jupiter all within two and a half degrees. And also moving into September 2nd, we have a double T-square taking place between Sun, Mars, Neptune and Sun, Saturn, Neptune, which represents this period as highly volatile. I will be expecting significant harmonic resonance right through the solar system during this time period, which may coincide with significant solar activity as well as very strong earthquakes felt here on the Earth. There are a series of planetary alignments taking place during this watch. Mercury is involved in two alignments in its own right, not only with Earth and Jupiter, but also moving in between both Sun and Mars. If that's not enough, we have significant interactions between Earth, Sun and Neptune. Earth will be moving into that alignment on September 2nd. And if that wasn't enough, we have another significant planetary alignment, heliocentric, between Venus, Sun and Uranus. This is a very important alignment and should ignite solar activity into high gear. It is important to know that September 1st is a total solar eclipse, where the Moon's arc will move across the Africa, Madagascar and Reunion Islands region. Now the concern is the Reunion Islands has a very active volcano, the Piton de la Fournaise, and it has become activated over the same Saros cycles, 135. The Moon cycle lasts 18 years, though the Moon continues this path every three lunar cycles, or every 54 years, and we have a look at previous cycles, Saros cycle 135, we see that 1908 and 1962 not only produced strong volcanic activity for the Paton de la Fournaise, but also rare earthquakes for Jamaica and also Ethiopia. Now look at the important lunar influences that will be in play during this watch. On August 22nd, the lunar perigee will take place, highlighting the solar eclipse path on the base of Africa, while the lunar declination on August 27 highlights the Atlantic Ocean at high latitudes. There are no less than six geocentric planetary alignments taking place, four of them occurring within the last nine days of August. Now the key period definitely is from August 24 through August 27. I suggest that this may be very high solar activity and this should precede any earthquake event activity which should be occurring towards month's end where strong earthquakes could be felt here on the Earth. Possible multiple events registered over 7.5 magnitude or one greater over 8 magnitude. And now the earthquake forecast which will highlight four regions which may be recipients of strong earthquakes during this watch. The number one or prime area of concern due to recurring symmetry of the Mars-Saturn conjunction is the Sea of Okhotsk. Now in 2008 and 2012, magnitude 7.7 .7 earthquakes were registered in the region and just so happens that the Mars-Saturn conjunction takes place just four years later. Now this will be the number one or prime area of concern during this watch and that is the Sea of Okhotsk or surrounding regions of the Kamchatka Peninsula, Kuril Islands or Sakhalin, Russia. The second area of concern will be for Alaska for this significant event. Other areas of focus will be Fox Islands, Gulf of Alaska or the Alaskan Peninsula. Now this area is susceptible to very strong earthquakes and also volcanic eruptions, so there may be a volcanic activation as well in this zone. My third area of concern is away from the Ring of Fire, specifically Romania could be at risk for a strong event, possibly lower in magnitude. But we do have three alignments that are taking place in August and September, highlighting Romania as potentially at risk for a strong and deep earthquake. And my final area of concern during this watch is the Philippine region. Now the Philippines has been affected with strong earthquakes back in 2012, where a 6.7 magnitude earthquake struck in Negros Cebu, and in 2013 an even stronger quake, magnitude 7.1, struck in Bohol. I am concerned that the strong planetary geometry which was in play in 2012 and 13 also occurs late August and also late in October, which may represent a strong earthquake for the Philippines to come. Other areas of focus will be the Luzon Philippines region, 
Mindoro Philippines and also the Philippine Islands region. And that concludes this important planetary alignment, earthquake and solar watch video covering late August into early September 2016. For more information please visit solarwatcher.net where there will be more content for members and subscribers as well as a website newsletter which will have much more detailed information contained within. Annotations and results of this watch will be added at the end of the video. Thanks for watching.